thank you for joining me. Today on Stacy Lee Beauty, we're going to be discussing some cruelty-free hair care items. So if that sounds interesting, keep on watching. So the brand I want to talk about today is called TLW, which stands for Three Little Words. I did receive this complimentary from the brand, but I was not required in any way to do a YouTube video. They just wanted an honest review on Instagram. But after trying the products, I liked them so much that I wanted to do a video and share this with you guys. I will have their website linked down below. It is not an affiliate link or anything like that. And I just want to link it so that you can go look up this stuff if you're interested in purchasing. So the brand, all their products are paraben and sulfate free and they are cruelty free. What I found was interesting is the products have UVA sunscreen to help with your color lasting longer. I don't color my hair, but I still want to protect my natural color. Their line consists of six products and their philosophy is they are designed to prolong the life of your style while reducing your drying time. And the brand name, three little words, so it's TLW, just if you forget how, if you forget about it, just say, okay, three little words. Um, all of their products have the three little words on it. And that is to bring a smile to your face when you're using their products. So I think that's really cool. I like how their products are designed. Because you have the three little words that kind of gives it the cutesy feeling, but their packaging is in a sleek design. So they'll look nice in your bathroom. And I just, I really like the packaging. The founder is Deb, and I'm not even gonna try to pronounce her last name. If you've been watching my channel at all, I am bad at pronunciation, so I will just put her name at the bottom of the screen here. She has spent 37 years in the hair and beauty industry. I do recommend washing your hair two to three times a week, and that is to give the natural oils a chance to replenish. So I wanna walk through the products. I really like Briagio shampoo and conditioner. When I use that, my hair always feels just kind of replenished and soft. I got the same feel from the shampoo and conditioner that my hair just felt bouncy and soft and I really liked how it revived my hair. Each of the products are $20, except for their little hair shot is $10. So everything else is $20. They're made in Australia. And if you're like me, when I read that, I thought, Geez, shipping is gonna be crazy expensive, but no, they have you covered. If you're in the US, a flat rate of shipping is $4.95 for your standard shipping. And if you're international, it's $20. So you can rest assured that shipping is not gonna cost you a fortune. Well, all of their products I would describe as kind of having a fresh tropical almost scent to them. They're not overpowering, but there is a little bit of that scent except for the oil. I don't notice that scent in there. But the shampoo is Laughter is Best. They have the ingredients on the back here. The shelf life is 12 months after you open it. And just to forewarn you, you will not get the foam when you use the shampoo. They do not add any of the agents in it, so that's why you're not gonna get it foamed up when you use it. But it smells so good yeah just kind of tropical i would say i'm not sure exactly what all the scent is. the conditioner is called winter is coming and they both have that kind of topper next would be the hair shot and it's that size and again this is ten dollars and this is to put into your damp hair and you put this in as a leave-in treatment when your hair is damp and just mostly concentrating on the ends and it's gonna lock in the hydration. Number three is a texturizing spray. I did not have that in my package, but that again is $20. Texturizing spray is if you're going to let your hair air dry. That's what they re recommend it for. If you're going to blow dry your hair before you do, they recommend using these two products together. This is the Let's Get Naked Frizz Fighter and Let's Get Tacos Treatment Oil. So use those together before you blow dry. And then after blow drying, if you feel like you still have a little bit of frizz or anything and you want just a little bit more protection, then you can use the treatment oil on its own once your hair is dry. Now during the week, in between shampoos, if you feel like you need to give your hair a little bit of boost or you're getting, if you're like me, I get flyaways all the time, 
they say to use the Let's Get Tacos, the treatment oil. And here's what the packaging looks like. I just love that name. And even though on the website, they say to use the Let's Get Naked, the Frizz Spider on wet hair, I've actually used it on dry hair and I like it on dry hair as well. And I do have an unboxing and my first impressions when I got this over on my Instagram, I will leave that handle down below if you wanna go check that out. And just one more FYI, if you wanna see how I created this eye look, this will be in a later video. I am currently working on doing a few looks with the Pure Barbie palette. Okay, now that that's out of the way, I wanna show you what these look like on dry hair. I'm gonna use the Let's Get Tacos and Let's Get Naked. So if you see, my hair is pretty good, but you can see like I always get these little flyaways back here and you know, it's just, it's not too frizzy. I've definitely had it worse, but you know, it's got a little bit to it. So let's use the Frizz Fighter. And again, they recommend this on damp hair before you blow dry. That's the formulation. I'm just gonna rub it together. I put it here. Oh man, that smells so good. Once you put it on your hair though, it's not like the scent lingers, but it smells so good. It makes me feel like I should be on vacation. I'll wipe my hands off. And then we're going to put the treatment oil on this side. And like many oils, when you use this, your hands, you know, are going to feel the oily when you're washing them. And so I would just say, you know, be aware of that the cap does kind of get a little oily on here. So you'll probably need to wipe that off. Okay, so put that in my hand. We're just going to work that through. Concentrating on the ends here. And up here so I think it's coming across on camera it is in person but that the flyaways have been calmed down and that my hair just kind of has a nice finish to it but it doesn't make it look greasy or wet I personally think you can use either one after you've blow dried and I just think that it gives a nice finish to the hair a lot of times when I've tried different oils they look kind of like wet or did not ask me to make this video. I just really liked their products, so I wanted to share it with you. And I'd love to know down below what you think of this and if any of these products grabbed your attention. Thank you to TLW for letting me try these. I am so happy that I did, and I definitely am going to be using these up. So thanks for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Bye.